Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you your daily general message for Tuesday, June 1st. Can you believe it? 2021. Uh, please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in a private one, all the information is down below in the description box below. Let's get started. Whomever this is meant for, I pulled a 10 card spread, five above, five below. I did clarify the one card as well as an outcome and two clarifiers. Guys, I love giving multiple messages, but this is a direct message for whomever this is meant for. Uh, somebody wants to heal a situation, is trying to have the kahugas. The my favorite word be scorp, isn't it now? <laughs> Somebody's having looking towards the past, trying to have the encouragement, the strength here to fix things. The star card is known for a healing energy in regards to once upon a time uh, having this happiness and making a decision to show the action in regards to this relationship here with the Hierophant. What's their decision? Uh, to start anew. To actually have a new start of action coming in and putting in the work, okay? Uh, the Eight of Pentacles is putting in the work, putting in that conversation, and moving on forward to the future here, okay? Uh, now, for some, oh, there is another message here. Uh, I feel that there's definitely a lot of frustration to kind of man up energy here, to kind of just drop the burdens of it all and just go for it. little paranoia whether or not they are going to accept them back. I do feel with the outcome card, it is the five of wands. So for some out there, I do feel that there was a struggle, that there was a change here in regards to this relationship. And for some, there was a fight. Five of Wands is known for a big fight here. So it's kind of like, come on, let's just get past this. Let's have this movement. Can we please just drop the burdens? The chariot here is known for that movement. It's turn looking at the Ten of Wands. Let bygones be bygones. That's my favorite term whenever I see that Ten of Wands. She's turned looking. Can we actually forgive each other? Can we actually get past this kind of energy here? What's wild is, is that you have the Nine of Wands as well as the Ten of Wands here, okay? So subtracting that would be the Ace of Wands and hello, there it is. So that's just confirmation to me that I do feel that somebody in regards to a decision made, in regards to a relationship here, they want to make nice, nice, they want to show the action, and they do want to put in the work. Now for some, there is a second message. Of course, in regards to, not everybody's going to be in this, okay, category, Third party situation, a decision, a choice here that needs to be made with the two of wands of showing the action in regards to a third party, I feel. I feel that they want, they know what they want now. They want to put in the work in regards to their true love here. And I feel that they want to heal a situation. I do feel, yeah, it's, it's a third party. I just heard cat fight. Uh, but yeah, so yeah, so basically there was a fight here. I'm feeling that the fight really took place in regards to a conversation that took place in regards to a third party situation. Things changed, okay? And now this dude here, the King of Swords, does represent air, does not have to be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But I do feel it's kind of like, hmm, you think we can start over? I, there's a little bit of nervousness here. I do feel that that party, in regards to the third party situation, the, the person who had that third party has made a decision to pick one person now, okay, as well. They see the light, they see that they were wrong kind of thing, but they really need to have the strength, the encouragement here to work on things, to heal the situation. I really feel that they will, all right, Aquarius as well as Leo, just pointing that out. In regards to making a decision, this is non-third party. But I do feel that somebody is making a decision here to bring back the happiness after a tough time. All right. I am very eager, very, very eager to work on this relationship here and to drop the burdens. Very nice energy. Drop the burdens here and start anew. Have a clean slate is what that tells me. Can we do it? I don't know. Can we have this movement? Can we put work back into this again is what this tells me. And have this movement. Now, it's interesting is the six of swords swords represent not this card represents not just moving forward but it's actually communication so the sword energy is that communication so can we move forward can we talk it out basically is what that tells me that's what they're kind of wondering if they can work things out with you i feel but i do feel that they're kind of hesitant can we start over will they accept me back is what the question really is because it's funny because the full card here is kind of like well what do you plan on doing son Hmm, let me think about that with his little, uh, look, 
he has like a little British bear hat on his head. Isn't that cute? But yeah, look at that. I, I don't notice these things, but definitely I feel it's kind of like <sighs> British bear hat. Did you know that they have the guards actually wear bear hats? I didn't know that. Uh, but yeah, it's pretty cool. But yeah, he's turned looking at it kind of like, can we communicate? Can we work this out? That's the question of the year, okay, for this day. But I definitely feel that somebody really, really is, is remorseful, non-third party, like, okay, uh, and wants to put in the work. They want things to be kind of just swept away and to talk it out and to work on things. And kind of like a, not to, not to sound like, mm, to irritate somebody, but it's kind of like, ugh, we've been through worse. We can get past this. Come on, let's do this, you know? Uh, but that's that's what it feels like to me. Now, in regards to a third party, I feel that somebody has definitely made a choice, made a decision, and returning. Kind of still a little nervous whether or not they will be, <clears throat> excuse me, well received back into their life again. But that's what I have, guys. I hope that this helps. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for supporting my channel. Guys, please take the time to smash that like button. It really does help my channel. You guys rock. Be safe out there. Have a great rest of your day, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.